All right, guys, today I'm here at Oakton High School doing a little sneak preview of our post-renovated theater here. So this project got started back in, I want to say May, is when we did some of the demolition work, taking all the old lights down from the catwalk and stuff like that, and it's been under construction ever since then. So we're almost done, or they're almost done in here. Um, I hear they want to be fully done by no later than spring break, so it's coming along. I still got a couple things to do, finishing touches, but I'm going to go ahead and give you a, a sneak peek at what the, the new Oakton Cougar Theater is going to look like. So we do have the old seats. The seats were reused, reinstalled. They're the same seats, uh, basically back in the same spot. The floor was painted recently. I believe it also gets carpet in the aisles. We got some new tormentors right here on both sides. We got a fresh coat of paint on basically everything. And behind me, we're on the stage. We got all new wood floor. Very nice. All right, so over here, this is stage left side. We got our handicap lift required by ADA. This is the freight lift that will eventually be used to move the set pieces and whatever from the stage level here to the hallway level. And then eventually across the way there, there will be another roll up door like this that goes into the scene shop. That's the next phase of this project. Got a door here. And then we got our piano storage area, or really a whatever storage area. <clears throat> Come back here, we got our brand new cyclorama, rear traveler, leg, scrim, another leg, mid traveler, and another leg and our main curtain right here. All these curtains are new, all the tracks are new, all the rigging's new. And the front, mid, and rear curtains are all motorized. So you got the controls right here. This is our central cabinet for all of our uh, rigging. J.R. Clancy um, power lift rigging system. Um, so it's, we've got, what do we got? We got five motors, first electric, second electric, third electric, and then a scenery baton right there that's variable speed, and then our fourth electric. Fourth electric has all the psych fixtures on it, which are all LED. This is a combination LED and regular uh, incandescent stage light fixture school. So it's got some LED spotlights, LED wash kits, and then a bunch of uh, conventional fixtures as well. Um, eventually, I'll be bringing two moving lights back here. They were taken out during the renovation so they could stay safe and not get dirty. So that's the rigging. Over here, we have this new room. Still needs a door put on it. This is our new dimmer room. We got two strand C21 dimmer racks. This is the new style with the new controller. And we got our uh, lighting network rack here. All that fun stuff. We got emergency light controls here for the uh, LED house lights. We got a panel here that has a lot of the uh, stage equipment circuits fed from. Then we got our emergency lighting transfer switch right here. That's the disconnect for that. And of course we've got our Mitsubishi mini split. Not operational yet, but it will keep this room nice and cool year round. You can see they're working on evacuating that and charging it. So that's in here. Still needs a door and the floor done, but it's coming along. And we can go ahead and, uh, what else we got? Well, we got the brand new touch panel over here, which is the interface for the whole lighting system. 
Still waiting on training for that. And you can see we got a bunch of uh, plug-in boxes now and network ports all over the stage. There's more of those plug-in boxes back here. Three circuit or four circuits plus a network jack. Got another door over here out into the hall and we can go up to the catwalk now. As you can see the catwalk is all diamond tread now safer and you don't drop anything down through the bar grating. Here's our catwalk, well catwalk storage area. So this used to, let me get some light here, let's see. This part used to drop down, down there, um, and they raised it up so you got some more storage now. And then over here, this will also eventually be another storage room when all this old electrical is demolished. So that'll be some nice extra storage. We come up here. This is our catwalk. We expanded the opening right here, as you can see. We've got 36 circuits of lighting or stage lighting up here and a whole bunch of fixtures basically goes all the way to the end and there used to be a ladder that dropped down here but now it's just dry drywalled off and then we got some steel mesh to keep people from crawling out over the ceiling like they used to. So this is nice, it's all cleared out, cleaned out. Uh, big opening catwalk. So that's that. Head back down. Through here. And back down again. Here's a look at our ADC uh, curtain motors. We got three of those, like I said, for the front, mid, and rear curtains. And then there's one of those JR Clancy power lift motors for our motorized electrics. come down into the house you can see we got all new lighting new tile new doors and this was the old stage dimmer room it's still got some few panels in here that'll eventually go away this will just be a storage room and if we come over to the other side also got two line arrays here, JBL uh, VRX series line arrays for sound. None of that is hooked up yet. Got more new tile. And then this is the bottom of the handicap lift as required by ADA. Hello. This is another storage room. Also used to have some dimmers in it. Now it's just got some HVAC controls here. So that'll be a nice storage room. Got our projector screen waiting to be installed. We'll head up to the back of the house here. Got our booth up there, same location, same size. This is our sound mixing platform with its own door. Again, an ADA requirement. It's a level slab. Uh, you can do all your sound mixing and whatnot. You can see we're gonna have our patch panel right here. Sit out here when you need to mix musicals and whatnot. Now we'll head up into the booth. 
lights on. Eventually they'll come on. There we go. Here's our booth, still doing some work up here, but we got our Strand Neo console and Neo playback wing up here. So I have not had any training on this yet, but I'm sure that'll be coming soon. So that'll be fun. This is where the sound console or sound rack will eventually be. With all the wire. And then on each side we got a little spotlight gallery. It's own light switch and intercom, so that's nice. Same thing on this side. And of course, we also got our own Mitsubishi AC in the booth. Keep the technicians and the equipment nice and cool. Got a nice countertop, some storage here, and some drawers. So that's nice, we got another touch panel right here for everything. All your uh, house and stage presets, stuff like that. Again, I have not received training on that yet. TBD. So yeah, that's just a little sneak peek at the uh, auditorium, or the almost almost renovated auditorium of Oakton High School. Like I said, they want to be, I think they want to be in here no later than spring break. So, they're doing mostly finishing touches right now. A lot of the low voltage stuff still needs to be done. That'll be a HDMI input eventually. Uh, most of the, I'd say most of the major work is done. It's just going back and doing all the, the little things. Like floors and doors and carpet and whatnot. But yeah, that's just a quick sneak peek of the Oakton Cougar Theater. And uh, we'll have to do another tour once it's done. So yeah, um, like and subscribe. And thanks for watching.